Right, it's a long time since I've been on one of these. Uh, they were shut during the pandemic and I haven't stayed at the Thistle in a while. So, we need to touch the screen to start and we are going to the Thistle. That's right. And off we go. Pods are the same, slightly different advertising on them. When you're ready, press the button to close. There's room for four, unless you've got a ridiculous amount of luggage. So, we close our door. Now that's the first time I did this. I uh, just sat here for ages and didn't bother pressing start. Anyway, off we go. Definitely press start. Five minutes. Well, there you go. Now, I've filmed this before during the day, a good few years ago now, and uh, got thousands of views. I will put a little bit of music on this, and I will stop chatting. But uh, let's see what we see at night time. Now, although it kind of looks like they might be on a track, they're not on a track. They are guided, so they can't go anywhere. But these are cars. They're not. They're not trains. They're not. Um, it's not like the shuttle over at Gatwick Airport. You know, these are independent, autonomous, autonomous vehicles. What a good word. See what we can see out of the other side. Here we go, Heathrow Pod does not produce any emissions. That's the airport over there. Not the greatest view though. And that's Terminal 5. And that reflection in me. Well, we're coming up to our five minute mark. If you are going to be taking the pods, basically you just get out of the car park, walk over to the gate. If you have a code, if you've pre-purchased, you put your code in. And if you haven't pre-purchased, you uh, just press the intercom and they'll give you a code and charge you six or seven pounds. It says on the website six pounds, but I spoke to the hotel today and they said seven. Anyway, thank you for joining me on my little pod journey. Hope that was amusing. 
Uh, I think it's a great thing. The reason I'm doing it is, yes, I want to film a little bit of the thistle because their platform is back open. Also, it's a third of the price of a Sofitel. I've got a morning flight tomorrow. I'm actually off to Bulgaria. And basically, I just want the ease of this. So, I've checked my bag at Terminal 5, get in the pod, get to the hotel, buy to eat, watch some aeroplanes, go to bed, get on the pod, go to the airport, get on an aeroplane. Uh, that's why I'm using the pod. So, that is our station. There we go. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed that, like, thumbs up, share, all those good things. Cheers guys, bye for now. So that's me, I've just got out of the pod. And if I remember rightly, I just walked through the car park, just over there. So that lit up gate. Will, uh, will allow me to get into the hotel. Like I said, I haven't got a code, but I have spoken to the hotel. And uh, they will let me in on the intercom and uh, I'll pay them at reception. What do I press? For assistance. Towards you. Towards me. Yeah. Brilliant. Done that. Thanks very much. And now I go to reception. Which she says is that way. But it's not. It's that way then that way. So I've been here for years. Well, three, four years. Right. Anyway. That's how you use the pods at the Thistle. Uh, there are videos on the Thistle. I'll put the links at the end of the video. Uh, if that was useful, mildly entertaining, please give it a like, subscribe, and uh, share it with anyone, you know, who's going to Heathrow and might need the pod. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.